Hello, my friends, and welcome back once again to House Flipper. Is it time to buy a new house? There's a site you can check for rundown houses. That's good to know. It's my money. Okay, let's see what we have. Oh yes, look at all these little houses that we could be buying and flipping. Before we do that, let's do whatever these are, because these might unlock more tools for us. Room for my grandson. Dear Mr. PC. I guess that's me. My only grandson will be staying with me for a while, and I want to prepare a room of his own. Sadly, he doesn't visit often, and I wish it would change. He is very dear to me. My old bedroom in the attic should be perfect for this. I don't use it anymore since my knees aren't what they used to be, and it's not easy for me to climb all those stairs every day. I've already cleaned it a bit on my own, but I could really use some help with painting and furnishing. Yours sincerely, Margaret Fontana. Oh, Margaret, we'll help you out. All right, Margaret, what's going on? There's nothing to do out here. There shouldn't be much to do anywhere until we get in. What is this? Some sort of novel about... I don't care. Ooh, that is... There is some terrible wallpaper in here, but that's not my job. Lots of cookbooks. Where are we going? That's the bathroom. We need to go up to the attic, don't we? Oh, Margaret's calling. Good Hello? morning, my dear. It is Margaret Fontana calling. I would like to tell you a bit about my grandson, Johnny. Okay. After all, your job is to prepare a room for him. And I really wanted to make him feel at home right away. I even bought some of his favorite books so he can have them here. Is it him in the pictures? Oh, you found my little gallery. Yes, it is. Here's the boy reading a book. Johnny, my little sunshine. He loves reading. The book in the picture is his favorite. The Many Adventures of Traveling Frog. I gave it to him when he was just a toddler. I remember like it was yesterday. Him sitting on my lap, listening to me, reading out loud. Now he says he's too big for that. Doesn't want grandma's help with anything. What else does he like? I remember him saying he wants to see the world one day. To travel like the hero of his favorite book. There was a chapter he really loved. Why did Frog take the train? He talked about traveling the globe by train for months. I bought him a toy train as a reminder of his early childhood dream. I put it with the books in the box in the attic. Can you display it nicely when you finish with everything else? Oh, I hope very much Johnny will like it here. So please, take good care of preparing his room. Have a nice day, my dear. Goodbye. Bye. All right, let's get to work. We've already started. First things first, let's get rid of all of this old, busted stuff. Then we'll start cleaning. A lot of old newspapers. Most of what's here in the bathroom looks like it could stay. There's no reason for this to not be put where it's supposed to be. I can squeak the duck. That's cool. Okay, yeah, let's start cleaning now. Let's do garbage first, actually. Because <laughs> there's just some random cardboard kicking around. What about this chair? I guess I can stay. So not a lot of trash, actually. Just a lot of cleaning that needs to get done. Honestly, this place has a really nice view. Looks like we might need to do some painting up there. Or replacing some of whatever is worn down. Get around to that when we get around to that. A few more stains in this room. Ah, yes. Where the pet was. Alright, let's clean the, the other rooms before we start furnishing. Alright, that room is tidy. Let's tidy up the bathroom now. And that is clean, just gotta do the windows now. Make them squeaky clean. The view from the bathroom isn't as nice as the view from the bedroom, but that's okay. I feel like we were just here, didn't we do one of these houses? Maybe not. Probably around here somewhere. Alright, we need to do some paint. Cyan and yellow. So the whole room... I think we're gonna do mostly yellow. 
and then we'll do a cyan accent wall on the window side. Or we could do cyan on this side. Let's do, let's see how that looks. Yeah, I think this is gonna look good. What's going on? All right, we'll finish off this yellow wall here. Then hopefully this idea actually pays off and ends up looking nice. I'm thinking of a maybe a different idea might have been interesting to do this whole bottom. Let's let, let me see. I know I already painted this and I'm just painting over it, but this might look nicer. This is a very Vault Tech theme. New painting perk unlocked. <laughs> That's terrifying. Not setting a boundary first. I don't know if I ever want to unlock that. Let's not do that for now. <laughs> that feels like a downgrade. Getting rid of the barrier. Yeah, I like that. I think that looks good. Okay, before I open up those boxes, let's do the rest of the shopping for this room. Single bed. Since it's just the one, I think we'll set it up like this. Is there anywhere this radiator should go? I think there's only one place it can go. Wait, should it go low? Yeah, you know what? Let's put it down here. I think I might need to move this chair. Poster's kind of ugly, but maybe the kid likes crayfish. I don't know. It's none of my business, is it? All right, a skateboard, a basketball. That's a bookend, I think. I don't know how many books he's gonna have, so. Don't know how far those should be spaced out. There we go, there's the little train. I don't know how much of this there is, so I'm just gonna set it up here for now. Uh-oh. It's just decorative, right? It's symbolic. Oh, there's so much more train than I was expecting. There we go. Good enough. I think that's cute. This room is finished. It's like this room is just storage. A little change room. This room is complete, and it looks good, too. And then the bathroom, nothing to do. That's it. We're done. I really like what we've done here. There's a lot of open space over here. Cool little train setup. You can play with those and do something better with them. I'm not... A model train guy, so I don't really know what to do with them. But yeah, I think that's a cool room. I think the paint looks good with the bottom little cyan base and the yellow on top. I am happy with this. And for 10 grand, very happy. That's good. We did it. Waiting to see if Tom tries to call me again. He doesn't. Do we unlock any new tools doing that? I don't think so. None of these really feel like they would unlock anything new. But we do need to get to the wall stuff. You probably haven't heard about it before, but our family house hosts, only, hosts the only Lumberjack Museum in Pinna Cove. Not for much longer, I'm afraid, since my wife and I are very busy these days and we have few visitors, we've decided to close it. We want to use the space as a proper living room instead. We need help with cleaning it out and replacing the furniture. There's also a small guest bathroom that we would like to turn into a laundry room. I've heard that you're a reliable person and can help with our request. We'll pack the family souvenirs before your arrival, but please remember to unpack them after the new furniture is placed. Kind regards, Woodrow Forrester. Okay, so I guess this is the museum over here that's going away? Yeah. Oh, definitely. And there's a little bit of tidying up inside to do. Okay, we'll handle this. Oh, this is the museum. So what is this? This is just another part of the museum? Let's deal with this. Oh, we don't have to do anything in here. Never mind. Let's not deal with this. Let's deal with outside first. We gotta sell the sign and the door, buy some plants. Got it. Goodbye to the sign, goodbye to the door. Oh wow, there's no way in now. Then they want to buy some trees and stuff. Okay, put a little tree out here by the front of the path. Are you trying to fill- oh, maybe they're trying to fill in this area here? Let's do that instead. There we go. That'll do. Alright, what's first? We gotta sell a bunch of stuff. Looks like museum stuff, and then do a little bit of tidying up, and then buy some door frames. Okay. Some of this stuff is hideous anyway, so it's okay to see it go. Oh my gosh, I'm getting just 
destroy the doors. It's funny to make the doors go away. I don't know why that amuses me so much. What else needs to be sold? Oh, the bathroom sign. Where is that? Oh, there it is. Okay, they want one large door frame. I guess right here. Looks appropriate. Did we not buy it? There we go. Just didn't go in. And then we need another one right here. Like that. And then one normal size door frame can go right here. Beautiful. Now we just need to tidy up a little bit. No, nope. hello? Hello, glad I managed to catch you. Your work is going well, I hope. I forgot to mention that we also want the old living room redone. You see, that small room served as our home office as well. Both me and Jill, my wife, have paperwork to do from time to time. And we could use a proper space for it. Though, I wish we didn't have to close the museum at all. Must have been a difficult decision. Of course. This museum was opened by my father. He was a lumberjack, like his father and grandfather before him. But then, the Ascenso came with their environmental specialists. After their lobbying, my father had to close his business. I became a carpenter to honor the family tradition. But this museum was the only place to learn our history. Really? Why? Well, this town got flooded with fish, so to speak. Everyone will tell you that this used to be a fishing village. But would it have been able to grow without the lumberjack community? Will fish help you build a house? And a smell, too. Nothing compared to freshly cut timber. But Asenzo convinced everyone that we're destroying the forest. And that was the beginning of the end. That sounds rather fishy. That's what I was saying. Anyway, it's very nice of you to care. That's rare these days. But I guess now you might have more pressing matters to attend to. Like covering the last signs of my family's legacy. Just kidding. And thank you for your hard work. <laughs> That room's done, I think. Yes, it's complete. I'm outside. We don't have to be outside. This room here, we want to sell some of the junky old furniture and just get some new stuff, it looks like. Get rid of the TV, and what are we doing with all these? Just let them fall on the floor? Okay. Sounds good to me. We're going to buy a new desk, so be able to do something with that. I wonder if I'm supposed to get rid of this rug? Nope. How about we put this stuff for here? Since this bookshelf, or whatever this is, isn't going away, we can get these out of our way. Alright, new desk. I'm actually thinking maybe on this side. On the carpet, so you're not scuffing up the wood floors. That's reasonable to me. I always do that. I always put the... I continue to put the laptop on backwards. There we go. Everything for this room looks good. Right, I was outside. Did we do this room? Nothing to do. Wonderful. Upstairs. Is there anything up here that needs to be done? Feeling like there isn't. Yeah, I think... Whoa. You have enough plants? Who are these people? Call mom. Post it. Call mom. Content. Sus. I should keep an eye out because I found that beaver in one of those houses. And I was able to collect it. I can't be here all day looking through things. Whatever. If we find one, we find one. If we don't, we don't. Was there anything I have to do in here? No. Wonderful. The upstairs can be left alone. This is not the other shed that we were in. Okay, we got a little bit of garbage to take care of. Hello? I walked into a glass door. There's a lot of bagged garbage in here. Where did it all go? Terrible shot. Wow, that tree got in my way. That was my fault. See? Don't have to clean the carpets. Just sell the carpets with all the dirt on them. I don't even know what that thing is that fell on the ground there, but it had to be sold anyway. Okay, I think we'll clean here first. Oh, those are some tough stains. Look at that floor shine. Oh, that's where the door was. That's why there's a little door mark there. Didn't quite get that. Okay. So we've already put in the door. Let's start off by putting in a rug. Nice little sofa. This will be a cozy room. An armchair. Maybe over here in the corner. Wait a minute. They want a TV cabinet. Oh, okay. 
We're not getting rid of the fireplace, though, are we? We can move it. Let's not do that. That's where the that's where the chimney is. Okay, let's rethink what we're doing here then. Hmm. How would we do this? We can finish. We can leave. We've only done half the room. Oh, the light switch is there. Oh, that's annoying. Maybe this isn't supposed to go there, then. Because I feel like this goes on the side, and it looks nice like that. Maybe this does go here. Small coffee table. Oh, wait. Do they want more than one? Or does this just not count where I put it? Oh, they need two. Oh, okay. I guess we're making a coffee table by sticking those two together. It's wonderful. Oh, we want two of these shelves? Okay, let's offset them a little bit. I think that looks nice like that. Okay, what's in these boxes? What are we gonna have to put up? An axe. That can go on the wall. That's cool. That moose. Wait, what is this? Oh, it just goes on a shelf. I was like, why can't I hang this on the wall? Alright, what's in the big box? Beaver. That reminds me, go check out my Timberborn series. It's on this channel. We're building cities with beavers. We're running out of room for these. Please don't be any more. That's okay, this is just a lumberjack man. Where do we want to put this one though? Right here, right at the entrance. This is probably his father. Alright, I think we're done. This came out alright. Yeah, I like this. Looks cozy. Can we turn on the lights in this room and see how it looks? Yeah, this looks nice. Oh, that was already closed. Turn on all the lights so we can see how it looks. I think it looks good. Yeah, this is nice. Alright, we're done here. Lumberjack Museum is closed, but this home is got like a little new lease on life. Got the Italian flag. Very cool. We're done here. I'll take my $7,600. Goodbye. Three stars. Fantastic. We're doing well. We still haven't learned how to demolish and build walls yet. But we're making progress. We've got a decent amount of cash in our pockets now. For now, I think it's time to say goodbye. And don't forget, if you've enjoyed this video, right below the video, you can hit the thumbs up icon and leave a like. And while you're down there, you can leave a comment. Tell me what you think of House Flipper 2 so far. And while you're also down there, why don't you hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so you can find out when new videos get posted. All right. Thank you very much for joining me. Thank you for being a part of this. Thank you for hanging out. Goodbye for now.